friends keep asking me what makes me sad and still And why my brow is darkened like the clouds upon a hill Run in your ponies closer and I'll tell to you my tale Of you tall Carol my father and his last ride on the trail On his funeral morning I heard the preacher say I hope we'll all meet you, Tar, wrapped around the pathway. They wrapped him in a blanket, but saved his little friend. And it was this red blanket that brought him to his end. <laughs> well, hi there, pluckers. I have a sore fingers again with an old cowboy song from Marty Robbins called Utah Carol. Okay, uh, nice and easy song for you for a change. Okay, nothing difficult here. Standard tuning, capo on the third fret, puts us into the same key as Marty Robbins. Okay, now what you heard there was the intro, or my version of the intro, simplified version, uh, the first verse and the very last verse, and how it finishes. Because in between those two verses, there are another six. <laughs> There's eight verses in this song. And they play exactly the same with different words. Okay, so once you've got a verse, you've got the whole song really. Okay, so uh, as far as playing it goes, you know. So let's get to it. So the introduction I played was I starting on the top E string, third fret from the capo. Top E string, third fret from the capo, and then I'm going to the fifth fret from the capo on the second string and the third string. Single hit on each one. Then two hits on the fifth fret from the capo on the top E string. Okay, so it's, it's quite, it's fairly quick. Got that? Now the second phrase is exactly the same to start with on that bit. So, right, and then it goes up to the tenth fret. Oh, sorry. Sorry, real life 10th fret. I mean, 7th fret from the capo, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 from the capo, top E string, single hit. Then the 5th fret from the capo, top E string, single hit. And then the 3rd fret from the capo, top E string, single hit. And then you finish on the 5th fret from the capo on the 2nd string. So, first phrase is... The second phrase is... So together, and the third phrase is again. It's the same to start with. Just those three: third on the first, fifth on the second, fifth on the third. A single hit on the fifth fret of the top E string, and then a single hit on the third fret of the top E string. So the last phrase is okay. So, all together, okay, that's what I play for the intro, and then you're into a C strum, okay. So it's root note, third on the fifth. the strum for all of the song really okay typical cowboy type of strum so let's try and do get into the song then okay, and then do a couple of strums on the C a couple of times around and then it starts singing okay so let's try and do the first line of the song for you. So the first line of the song is C and then it will go to an F and then back to the C. Okay, so let's just do that. And now my 
print you've asked me that makes me sad and still. Okay, so C to F to C. Now my friends, you've asked me F, what makes me sad and back to C still. And why, stay on the C, and why my brow is darkened like the G chord, however G chord like that or G chord like this. Hit the root note, the bottom E string, third fret. Same as the usual strum, back to the C. Okay, and now my friends have asked me what makes me sad and still, and why my brow is darkened like the clouds upon the hill. And then you go into an F. Run in, in on run in is an F. Okay, run in your ponies back to C closer, and I'll F on tell tell to you my back to C tell. Of you tall carol my partner and his G last every time you change chord you can hit the root note. Root note of is back to C tail. And then it just repeats another seven times with different words. Okay? So let's try and go through the whole thing very slowly. <clears throat> You've asked me what makes me sad and still And why my brow is dark and like the clouds upon the hill Run in your ponies closer and I'll tell to you my tale If you talk how my partner and his last ride on the trail The last verse And on this funeral morning I heard the preacher say I hope we'll all meet Utah at the roundup our way. And they wrapped him in a blanket and they saved his little friend. And it was this red blanket that brought him to his. Slows it right down, right at the last. This is the very last verse. It sort of slows down to almost a stop on the G, okay? So, was this red blanket. Oh, sorry, um, and it was this blanket that brought to him his C chord here. And that's how it ends. So you strum the C, brought to him his end, play the C, then the second string, keep the C chord fretted, second string, then the third string, then the top E string, then the second string. Then put your pinky, so then put your pinky on the top E string on the third fret, holding the C chord. Top E string, right, so it's and then second string, end up on the second string, and then finally another C. So second holding the C chord, second string, third string, top E string, second string, add your pinky to the top E string for the fret. Then the uh, second string, C. Take your pinky off and play the C chord, yeah? So go that. And there you have it. That's the very, that's how he ends the song. And so all the verses are exactly the same to play, just got different words and there's eight of them. <laughs> so I uh, hope that helps you play that song and uh, I'll see you in the next lesson, which probably will be a bit harder. <laughs> Bye for now.